capital I, small i. Are you ready? Let's begin. I. You say it. I. Yes, again. I. That's correct. I. I is both a letter and a word. I is a pronoun, meaning the person who is speaking or writing. I am wearing a red shirt. I have green eyes. I. Say it one more time. I. Yes, that's correct. Ice. 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 You say it. Ice. Yes, again. Ice. One more time. Ice. Well done. Ice is frozen water. The water in the river turned to ice during the winter. Ice also means to keep things cold. We must ice the meat to keep it fresh. Say it again, ice. Yes, well done. Ice cream, ice cream. You try it, ice cream. Yes, say it again, ice cream. That's correct. Ice cream is a sweet frozen dessert made from milk products. Mother gave her sons ice cream for dessert. We like to eat ice cream on a hot day. Say it again, ice cream. Yes, that's correct. Icicle, icicle, icicle. You try it. Yes, say it again, icicle. One more time, icicle. That's right, well done. An icicle is a long, thin stem of ice formed from dripping water that has frozen. There was an icicle hanging from our roof. Say it again, icicle. Yes, that's right. Idea, idea, idea. You try it. Yes, say it again, idea. Mm -hmm. One more time, idea. That's right. Idea means a thought, a plan, or an opinion. It was Zoe's idea to plant the trees in the park. The teacher said it was a good idea to do our homework early. Say it again, idea. Well done. Ideal, ideal, ideal. You say it, ideal. Yes, say it again, ideal. That's correct. Ideal means very suitable or perfect. Some people think cats are the ideal pets. Ideal. Identical, identical. You try it, identical. Yes, say it again, identical. One more time, identical. That's right. Identical means exactly alike. Those girls are identical twins. No one can tell them apart. Say it again, identical. Well done. Identity, identity, identity. You try it, identity. Yes, again, identity. Mm -hmm. One more time. Identity. Correct. Your identity is who you are. We need a driver's license so we can prove our identity. Again, identity. That's right. Idiot. 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 You say it. Idiot. Again, idiot. One more time. Idiot. That's right. An idiot is a person who is stupid or foolish. The baker said he was an idiot for leaving the oven unattended and allowing the cake to burn. Idiot. Say it again. Yes, well done. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. 
Learn English and have fun. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. If, 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 you say it. If, yes, again. If, one more time. If, well done. If is a word used to show that something will happen on the condition that another thing happens first. The boss will pay the worker she hired if he completes the job she gave him. If Jane practices the piano, she will learn to play beautiful music. If you watch the Hello Channel, you will learn to speak English. If, say it one more time, if. Yes, well done. Ignite, ignite, ignite. You try it, ignite. Yes, again, ignite. One more time, ignite. Correct, well done. Ignite means to set fire to something or to catch fire. The rising flames could easily ignite the trees above the house. Ignite, again, ignite. That's right, well done. Ignore, ignore, ignore. You say it, ignore. Yes, again, ignore. Mm -hmm. One more time. Ignore. That's right, well done. Ignore means to take no notice of something. Frances tried to ignore her aching stomach, but she was still very hungry. The mother taught her children to ignore any unkind behavior from other people. Ignore, say it again, ignore. Yes, that's right. Iguana. Iguana, iguana. You try it, iguana. Yes, again, iguana. One more time, iguana. Yes, that's right. Iguana means a large tropical lizard. Iguanas are found in the Americas. Say it again, iguana. That's right, well done. Ill. Ill, ill. You say it, ill. Mm -hmm. Again, ill. One more time, ill. Yes, that's right, well done. Ill has two meanings. Ill can mean to be sick. John was ill for an entire week. Ill also means something bad. The doctor asked her if she suffered any ill effects from her accident. Ill, say it one more time, ill. Well done. Illegal, illegal, illegal. Now you say it. Yes, again, illegal. Mm-hmm, one more time, illegal. Yes, that is correct. Illegal means against the law. Stealing is illegal in all countries. Say it again, illegal. Yes, that's right. Image, image, image. Now you say it, image. Yes, again, image. Mm -hmm. Repeat one more time, image. Yes, that's correct. Image has several meanings. Image can mean a picture that you have in your mind. She has an image of what she wants her house to look like. Also, your image is the way that you appear to other people. Image can also be a picture formed in a lens or a picture formed in a mirror. Katie stared at her image in the mirror image. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. Hey mom, why don't we all go 
little rollerblading tonight. Uh, not tonight, honey. Mom, spending time with me now means having a better chance of being close to me when I'm a teenager. How are you going to deal with that if we're not close? Give your family everything. Give them your time. From the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. For a brighter future, just say hello. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Imagine. 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 You say it. Imagine. Yes, repeat. Imagine. One more time. Imagine. Yes, that's correct. Imagine. Imagine means to picture something in your mind. The boy tried to imagine what it would be like to be a policeman. Can you imagine a world without any violence or war? Imagine. Say it again. Imagine. Yes, that's correct. Immaculate. Im mac you let immaculate say that with me immaculate yes let's repeat immaculate mm -hmm. one more time immaculate that's correct immaculate means very clean or neat jennifer's home is always immaculate say it again immaculate correct well done Immediate, immediate, immediate. Now you say it, immediate. Let's say it again, immediate. Yes, one more time, immediate. That's right, well done. Immediate means happening or done right away, at once. He sent an immediate reply to her letter. Say it again, immediate. That's right. Immense, immense, immense. You say it, immense. Yes, let's repeat it again, immense. Mm -hmm. One more time, immense. That's correct. Immense means huge or enormous. Luke has an immense collection of comic books. The hurricane left an immense amount of damage in the town. Say it one more time, immense. That's right, well done. Immigrant, immigrant, immigrant. Now you say it, immigrant. Again, immigrant. One more time, immigrant. Yes, that's right. Immigrant means someone who comes from abroad to live permanently in a new country. The immigrant family worked hard to learn a new language. Immigrant. Say it again. Immigrant. Yes, that's correct. Immoral. 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 Now you say it. Immoral. Yes, again. Immoral. One more time. Immoral. That's right. Immoral means unfair or without a sense of right and wrong. The girl's father said it was immoral to treat other people unkindly. Immoral. Say it again. Immune. 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 Now you try it. Immune. Mm -hmm. Let's say it again. Immune. Yes, one more time. Immune. That's correct. Well done. Immune means to be protected against a disease. Tim is immune to chicken pox because he has already had them. Immune. Say it one more time. Immune. Yes, that's right. Impact. Im Impact. Impact. Say it with me. Impact. Yes, 
Let's say it again. Impact. One more time. Impact. Yes, that's right. Well done. Impact has two different meanings. Impact means the force with which something or someone is hit or the force that someone hits with. The falling tree hit the ground with a tremendous impact. Impact also means the effect that something has on a person or a thing. The powerful motivational speech had a profound impact on all of the employees who listened. Say it again, impact. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. Learning English may be the biggest factor in the jobs you can get and the money you can earn. Hi, I'm Michelle, and I want to tell you about Hello Channel, an exciting new channel that teaches you English as you're watching TV. As you watch Hello Channel, you'll see, read, hear, and speak English, and before you know it, you'll be on your way to a better job and a brighter future. All you have to do is say hello. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Impair. 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 Now you say it. Impair. Yes, say it again. Impair. One more time. Impair. Yes, that's correct. Impair means to damage something or to make something less effective. Scientists warn that listening to loud music can impair your hearing ability. Say it again, impair. That's right. Impartial. 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 Now you say it, impartial. Yes, again, impartial. One more time. Impartial. Yes, that's right. Well done. Impartial means fair and not favoring one person or point of view over another. The jury consisted of impartial people. Say it one more time. Impartial. That's correct. Well done. Impatient. 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 Repeat with me. Impatient. Yes, again. Impatient. One more time. Impatient. That's right. Well done. Impatient means in a big hurry or unable to wait. Mike was growing impatient while waiting in the heavy traffic. Please don't be impatient with your little children. Impatient. Say it again. Impatient. That's right. Well done. Imply. 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 Now you say it. Imply. Mm -hmm. Please repeat. Imply. Yes, again, imply. That's right. Imply means to suggest or to mean something without actually saying the words. Jerry can imply his feelings by the sad look on his face. Imply. Say it one more time. Imply. That's right. Impolite. 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 Now you try it. Impolite. Again, impolite. One more time. Impolite. That's correct. Impolite means to behave in a rude manner. It is impolite to interrupt the speaker. Impolite. Say it again. Yes, that's correct. Important. 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 Now you try it. Important. Yes, let's say it again. Important. One more time. Important. Yes, well done. 
Important means something is worth taking seriously and can have a great impact. The scientist made an important discovery. The prime minister is an important person. Say it one more time, important. Well done. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. We learned English. Your kids can too. Just watch Hello Channel. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Impossible. 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 You try it. Impossible. Yes, let's repeat together. Impossible. One more time. Impossible. Yes, well done. If something is impossible, it cannot be done or it cannot be true. Teaching a pig to fly is impossible. Say it again. Impossible. That's right. Impress. 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 Say it with me. Impress. Yes, let's repeat. Impress. One more time. Impress. Well done. Impress means to make people think highly of you. Gary tried hard to impress his football coach. Impress also means to have an effect on someone's mind. His speech will impress the audience. The teacher hopes to impress upon her students a love for learning. Say it again, impress. Yes, correct. Improve, improve, improve. You try it, improve. Yes, again, improve. Mm -hmm. One more time, improve. That's right, well done. Improve means to get better or to make something else better. Betty studied to improve her score on her spelling test. Joe wants to improve as a swimmer. He will have to spend many hours in the pool. Improve. Say it again. Improve. That's right. Well done. Impulse. 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 You say it. Impulse. Again. Impulse. One more time. Impulse. Correct. An impulse is a sudden desire to do something without giving the action much thought. Tim acted on an impulse and bought the new set of skis. Many items for sale at the checkout stand are said to be impulse purchases. Say it again, impulse. Correct. In, in, in. Repeat with me, in. Again, in. One more time, in. That's right, well done. In means inside. Your socks are in the top drawer. Come in the house. Say it again, in. Correct. Inability. 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 You try it, inability. Yes, again, inability. Mm -hmm. One more time. Inability. Correct. Inability means lack of power or lack of ability to do something. Kate didn't get into the water because of her inability to swim. Say it again. Inability. Correct. Well done. Inadequate. 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 Now you say it, inadequate. Yes, let's try again. Inadequate. Mm -hmm. One more time, inadequate. 
Yes, that's correct. Inadequate means not enough or not good enough. The meal was inadequate for their needs. Say it again, inadequate. Yes, capital I, small i. Are you ready? Let's begin. Inappropriate. In a pro -priate. Inappropriate. Now you try it. Inappropriate. Yes, again. Inappropriate. Mm -hmm. One more time. Inappropriate. That's right. Good job. Inappropriate means unsuitable for the time, place, or situation. His casual dress was inappropriate attire for such a formal restaurant. The teacher asked the students to refrain from using inappropriate language. Say it again, inappropriate. Yes, well done. Inch, inch, inch. Now you try it, inch. Yes, again, inch. One more time, inch. That's correct. An inch is a unit of measurement. It's equal to one twelfth of one foot. The shoe was 10 inches long. I think my boy grew one inch over the summer. Say it again, inch. That's right, well done. Include, in, include, include. You say it, include. Yes, again, include. Yes, one more time, include. That's right, well done. Include means to contain something or someone as part of something else. Does the cost of our meal include dessert? Cindy wanted to include all of the girls in her classroom. Include, say it one more time, include. Right, correct. Income, in, come. Income, now you say it, income. Yes, again, income. Well done. Income is the money that a person earns or receives regularly. Beverly's income was not enough for her to afford her house payment. Say it again, income. Yes, correct. Increase, increase, increase. You say it, increase. Yes, please repeat, increase. Mm -hmm. One more time, increase. That's correct. Increase means to grow in number or size. They saw an increase in people purchasing motorcycles due to higher gasoline prices. Say it again, increase. Correct. Incredible, incredible, incredible. Now you say it, incredible. Yes, let's repeat again, incredible. One more time, incredible. Correct, well done. Incredible means something is unbelievable or amazing. Kim's pumpkins grew to an incredible size. Critics said the award-winning performance was incredible. Say it again, incredible. That's right. Independence, independence, independence. Now you try it, independence. Yes, repeat again, independence. Mm -hmm. One more time, independence. That's right, independence. Independence means freedom or the condition of being independent. Many countries have fought wars to gain their independence. Say it again, independence. Yes, correct. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. This is Hello Channel. Come learn English as you watch TV. It will change your life.
Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Indignant. 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 You try it. Indignant. Mm -hmm. Again, indignant. That's correct. Indignant means you are upset or annoyed because you feel that something is not fair or not right. Adam was indignant when he was wrongly accused of cheating in school. Indignant. Individual. 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 You say it. Individual. Let's repeat it again. Individual. One more time. Individual. That's right. Well done. Individual means single and separate. For the test, each student needs to know the names of every individual country. A single person is also called an individual. She is an intelligent individual with many accomplishments. Individual. Say it again. Yes, individual. Indoors. In. Doors. Indoors. You say it. Indoors. Again, indoors. Yes, one more time. Indoors. That's correct. Indoors means inside a house or inside a building. We stayed indoors because of the bad weather. Indoors. Industry. In. Dust. Tree. Industry. Now you say it. Industry. Again, industry. One more time. Industry. That's right. Well done. Industry is manufacturing companies and other businesses taken together as a group. The town needs more industry to advance in this bad economy. Say it again. Industry. Right. Inefficient. 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 Now you say it. Inefficient. Yes, again, inefficient. That's correct. One more time. Inefficient. Well done. Inefficient means something or someone doesn't work very well and wastes energy and time. The machine is inefficient because a person could do all the work in half the time. She is an inefficient worker because she talks all day long on the telephone. Say it again, inefficient. Yes, correct. Infamous. 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 Now you try it. Infamous. Yes, again, infamous. One more time. Infamous. Yes, correct. If someone or something is infamous, the person or thing is well known for a bad or a negative reason. Al Capone was an infamous gangster. Say it again. Infamous. Yes, correct. Infant. In. Fant. Infant. Yes, you say it. Infant. Again, infant. One more time. Infant. Yes, that's correct. Infant means a newborn child. The parents adore their sweet new infant. Say it again. Infant. Yes. Infect. In. Fact. Infect. Now you try it. Infect. Yes, again. Infect. One more time. Infect. That's right. Infect means to cause disease or to contaminate by introducing viruses or germs. Mosquitoes can infect people with malaria. Infect. We'll be right back after a short break 
with more Hello Word Power. You can learn English by watching Hello. Hey, Mom, why don't we all go rollerblading tonight? Give your family everything. Give them your time. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Inferior. 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 Now you try it. Inferior. Again, inferior. Yes, one more time. Inferior. Correct. Well done. Inferior means not as good as something else. The new house was of inferior quality. We missed our old home. Inferior. Say it one more time. Inferior. Correct. Well done. Inflate. 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 You try it. Inflate. Yes, again. Inflate. Mm -hmm. One more time. Inflate. Inflate means to make something expand by blowing or pumping air into it. You must inflate the bicycle tire with the air pump. Say it again, inflate. Yes, well done. Influence, influence, influence. Again, influence. Yes, repeat again, influence. That's right, well done. Influence means to have an effect on someone or something. Father has a great influence on his sons. Mothers hope their children are a good influence on the younger children in the neighborhood. Influence. Say it one more time. Influence. Yes, correct. Inform. In. Form. Inform. Now you try it. Inform. Yes, again, inform. Mm -hmm, correct. Inform means to tell someone something. Ben informs his mother about all the school rules. A teacher will inform all her new students about expectations in the class. Inform. Say it again, inform. Yes, correct. Information. In for me shun. Information. You try it. Information. Mm -hmm. Again, information. One more time. Information. Yes, well done. Information is facts and knowledge. Mark studied his map to gain information about the area we were visiting. We got the latest information on the radio. Say it again. Information. Yes, correct. Ingenious. 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 You try it. Ingenious. Yes, again. Ingenious. Mm -hmm. One more time. Ingenious. Correct. Ingenious means that something is inventive and original. Tom's plan for the new technology is quite ingenious. Say it one more time, ingenious. Correct. Ingredient, ingredient, ingredient. Now you try it, ingredient. Mm -hmm. One more time, ingredient. Yes, well done. An ingredient is one of the items that something is made from, such as an item of food in a recipe. Maria added the last ingredient to her recipe. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. You're watching Hello Channel. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. 
Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Inhabit. 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 You try it. Inhabit. Mm -hmm. Again, inhabit. One last time. Inhabit. Yes, well done. Inhabit means to live in a place. Kangaroos inhabit Australia. Inhabit. Say it again. Yes, correct. Inhale. 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 You try it. Inhale. Again, inhale. Mm -hmm. One more time. Inhale. Correct. Inhale means to breathe in. Like this. In the mountains, Joan can inhale clean, fresh air. Say it again. Inhale. Correct. Injure. 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 You try it. Injure. Yes, again. Injure. One more time. Injure. Correct. Injure means to harm or hurt. Be careful or you might injure yourself on the football field. The driver was injured in the auto accident. Say it again. Injure. Correct. Ink. 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 You try it. Ink. Yes, again. Ink. One more time. Ink. That's right. Well done. Ink is a colored liquid used for printing or writing. The pen ran out of ink. Say it again. Ink. Yes, that's correct. Ink. Insect. 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 Now you try it. Insect. Yes, again. Insect. One more time. Insect. That's right. An insect is a small creature with three pair of legs, one or two pair of wings, three main sections to its body, an exoskeleton, and no backbone. There are hundreds of different species of insects. Say it again. Insect. Correct. Well done. Inside. In. Side. Inside. Now you say it. Inside. Again. Inside. Mm -hmm. One more time. Inside. That's right. Inside means the interior or inner part of something. Chantelle asked us to come inside her house. Inside also means within. Put your lunch inside the backpack. Say it again. Inside. Correct. Insist. In. Sist. Insist. You try it. Insist. Again. Insist. Correct. If you insist on something, you demand it very firmly. Miguel will insist on riding his bike to school even though it might rain. I insist that you come in out of the rain. Say it with me. Insist. Correct. Inspire. 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 Now you try it. Inspire. Again, inspire. One more time. Inspire. Correct. Well done. Inspire means to fill someone with an emotion, an idea, or an attitude. The speech was meant to inspire the team into playing well. I hope watching this program will inspire you to keep learning English. Inspire. Say it one more time. Inspire. Yes, that's right. Instead. 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 Now you try it. Instead. Yes, again. Instead. One more time. Instead. Yes, that's correct. Well done. Instead means 
in place of another. Bill wanted ice cream instead of apple pie. Instead, say it again. Yes, instead. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. My name is Kate and you're watching Hello Channel. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Instruct. 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 Now you try it. Instruct. Yes, again. Instruct. Say it one more time with me. Instruct. Correct. Well done. Instruct means to teach a subject or teach a skill. The teacher will instruct her students on how to solve difficult math problems. I will instruct you on learning words in English. Say it one more time, instruct. That's right, correct, instruct. Instrument, instrument, instrument. Now you say it, instrument. Let's say it together, instrument. One more time, instrument. That's right, well done. An instrument is an object that you use to make music. The flute is a musical instrument. An instrument is also a tool for delicate or scientific work. A scalpel and a sponge are both surgical instruments. Say it again, instrument. Yes, correct. Integrity. 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 Now you say it. Integrity. Again, integrity. One more time. Integrity. That's right. Integrity means a person is honest and sticks to his or her principles. A person with integrity would never cheat on a test. He is known as a man of integrity. Say it again, integrity. Well done. Intellect, intellect, intellect. You try it, intellect. Repeat again, intellect. One last time. Intellect. Yes, that's correct. Intellect means the power of the mind to think, reason, understand, and learn. Albert Einstein is a genius known for his great intellect. Say it one more time. Intellect. That's right. Well done. Intend. 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 Now you say it. Intend. Again, intend. One more time. Intend. That's right. If you intend to do something, you really mean to do it. I intend to mow my lawn this weekend. Kevin intends to go to the party after work. Intend. Say it again. Intend. That's right. Intense. 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 You try it. Intense. Again, intense. One more time. Intense. Right. Intense means something is very strong. Jill has intense feelings about her career. The scary movie was an intense experience for everyone in the theater. Say it again, intense. Correct. Interest. Interest. Now you say it, 
interest. Again, interest. One more time. Interest. Yes, correct. If something interests you, you want to know more about it. Mark has an interest in learning to play the guitar. Interest is also a fee that is paid for borrowing money. The bank charges interest on all of its loans. Say it one more time, interest. That's right. Interior, interior, interior. Again, interior. One more time, interior. That's right. Interior means the inside of something. The interior of the home was painted light yellow. Interior. Say it again. I, small i. Are you ready? Let's begin. Invade. 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 Now you say it. Invade. Yes, say it again. Invade. One more time. Invade. Mm -hmm, well done. Invade means to send armed forces into another country in order to take it over. The soldiers plan to invade the island. Say it again. Invade. Yes, that's correct. Invent. 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 You try it. Invent. Yes, say it again. Invent. One more time. Invent. Well done. Invent means to think up or create something new. The writer wishes to invent a new world in his story. Can you invent a new machine? Invent. Say it again. Invent. Yes. Well done. Invest. In vest. Invest. Now you say it with me. Invest. Repeat. Invest. One more time. Invest. Well done. Invest means to give or lend money to something, such as a company, in a belief that you will get more money back in the future. They wanted to invest in a new restaurant franchise. Say it again, invest. Correct. Investigate. 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 Now you say it. Investigate. Mm -hmm. Again, investigate. Try one more time. Investigate. Yes, that's correct. If you investigate something, such as a crime, you find out as much as possible about it. The police had to investigate the scene of the crime. Investigate. Invite. 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 Now you say it. Invite. Again, invite. One more time. Invite. Well done. Invite means to ask someone to do something or to go somewhere. Holly wanted to invite her friends to her party. Say it again, invite. Yes, that's correct. Involve, involve, involve. Repeat with me, involve. Let's say it again, involve. Yes, involve. That's correct. Well done. Involve means to include something as a necessary part. The project will involve hours of library research. She wants to involve both boys and girls in the school production. Say it again. Involve. Yes, correct. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. Hello. That's right, I said hello. 
I'm talking about an exciting new television channel that will change your life. My name is Ruth and I want you to be one of the first to know about Hello Channel. Hello Channel is designed to teach you to speak English. Anyone can learn. We offer something for everyone. You'll see programming for children, teenagers and adults, all on different levels. With Hello Channel, you'll hear, see, read and speak English as you're watching entertaining television programs, making it easy to learn. If you've always wanted to learn English but haven't had a chance, Hello Channel is perfect for you. Start today and remember, for a brighter future, just say hello. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. I rate. I rate. I rate. You say it. I rate. Again, I rate. One last time. I rate. That's correct. I rate means extremely angry or annoyed. Father was irate when Dan damaged the car. Irate. Say it again. Correct. Iron. 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 Now you try it. Iron. Again. Iron. One more time. Iron. Yes, well done. Iron is a strong, hard metal used to make things such as gates or railings. Many ornate gates are made of iron. And iron is also a piece of electrical equipment, a small appliance that has a handle and a heated surface. And iron is used to smooth creases and wrinkles out of clothing. Bob needs to iron his wrinkled shirt before he goes to work. Say it again. Iron. Yes, that's correct. Irrigate. 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 Now you say it. Irrigate. Again, irrigate. Mm -hmm. One more time. Irrigate. That's correct. Irrigate means to supply water to crops by artificial means. The farmer must irrigate his fields every day during the hot summer. Irrigate. Say it again. Irrigate. Yes. Island. 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 Now you say it. Island. Yes. Again. Island. One more time. Island. Yes. Correct. An island is a piece of land surrounded by water. The Hawaiian Islands are very beautiful. Island. Say it one more time. Island. Well done. Issue. 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 Say it with me. Issue. Yes, let's say it again. Issue. Mm -hmm. One more time. Issue. Correct. An issue is a topic for discussion or debate. Many different issues will be covered during the meeting. Issue is also an edition of a newspaper or a magazine. He bought the current issue of his favorite magazine. Issue can also mean to send out or to give out. The school will issue us the necessary sports equipment. Issue. Say it again. Issue. That's correct. Well done. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. You can learn English if you'll just say hello. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. It. It. 
it. Now you try it. It. Mm -hmm. Again, it. One more time. It. That's correct. It is a pronoun. It is a word that replaces the name of a person, place, or thing. It is a red ball. Give it to her. It. Say it again. It. That's correct. Itch. It. Ch. Itch. Now you try it. Itch. Mm -hmm. Let's say it again. Itch. One more time. Itch. Yes, that's right. Itch means your skin is uncomfortable and you want to scratch it. The insect bites made Robert's skin itch all night long. Itch. Correct. Item. 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 Let's say it together. Item. Mm -hmm. Now you say it. Item. Again, item. That's correct. Item means one of a number of things. That dress is a pretty item of clothing. There are many items to purchase in the store. Say it again, item. Yes, correct. Ivy, Ivy, Ivy. You say it, Ivy. Yes, again, Ivy. Mm -hmm. One more time, Ivy. That's correct. Ivy is a green climbing plant. The brick building is covered with ivy. The woman decided to let the ivy grow all up the sides of her brick house. 